just dead here. I out, out on my Tiger 900 to do a night ride. And curiously enough, when I thought about it, I'd figure it out that it's been over a decade since I've ridden at night. So my last, I don't know, three or four motorcycles, I've really not ridden at night. What I mean not really, I mean, I've taken one to a down a block, but, but not really ridden it at night. So I don't know what it's like, how they act. So hopefully uh, I get a good idea of that tonight. I don't know how much of me you can see, or you can see of the road, but uh, that TFT on this thing is glorious at night. It's just beautiful. Uh, you can see the TFT real fine, and uh, if you look at my switches, you can see that they're all backlit. And uh, I've never had a bike with uh, backlit switches before. I think I can really like that. So, on the low beam. Well, on a two-lane dark road, I feel pretty comfortable at riding uh, about 55 miles an hour to 60 miles an hour. I'm going to switch on my uh, fog lights. There you go. Fog lights on. Which brightens, uh, right, right in front of me a little bit and also the uh, sides of the road left and right. Off, on. So that's pretty handy. Now let's go to the high beam. Oh yeah. The high beam is uh, something that I probably, on a two lane road like this, probably feel good at running about 70 miles an hour on. But not really, you know, 70 miles an hour I can see pretty bright. It does a good job. Uh, both sides of the road and in front of me. I'm pretty happy with that. I can see the signs down there. It really brightens up the signs. Uh, you can see the turn sign way up here. And these tail lights, the combination blinkers and tail lights that come on, are really bright. I'll show you those in the. This is what the uh, brake lights look like with a combination of blinkers. Pretty bright, huh? But I really like the high beam. Um, that's on, th on this particular bike, it's like a lot of bikes. When you're on low beam, you only have one of the lights illuminated. And high beam, you got both of them. One, both. One, both. So there's a big difference there. Without, and di now just the uh, fog lights with the low beams. It's better with the fog lights with low beams, but I don't know. I don't think, for me, that would be that great riding on a... I'd keep the speed under 60 on a, on a two-lane at night. Uh, your eyesight's probably better than mine. Well, this is just Dad saying good night, everybody.